Oh, Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. And his college degree. These boys aren't stupid. High school diploma. Daddy's baseball trophy. Hmm. Seems like it's been years since kids were playing sports for fun. This dairy must have meant a lot to them before the walkers destroyed everything. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Some kind of lotion. I could use a shave. Help! This must be Terry. so much morphine for candles smart musty as hell I guess someone needed some first aid recently Ugh, what is this stuff looks like a bunch of medical waste in here IV tube saline what would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff huh where is that cord going Where the hell is Mark? I thought Brenda said he was up here resting. Is that blood? Feels like there's a storm coming. Uh, farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. Find something? 
Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Well, thanks. Thanks. I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking what? Put your fuck? guns down! We're walking out Y'all of come here! Come here, my Mommy, fucking family! I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay! <gasps> Lee? Lee? <coughs> Let go of her, you son of a bitch! of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet- Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of Let bitches. Let us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! This goddamn thumbsucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Don't give up. Dad, We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Please settle down! I'll, I'll rip your goddamn head! Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah. I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. I'm not your enemy, Larry. I don't believe you. Don't forget, I know who you really are. Come on, try us out, fucking They got caught you and duck, Lee. Those fuckers have my family. I know. We're gonna get out of here and find them. There's more of us on the way. Hmm. Let us out. I'll, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, <laughs> Easy. Uh, oh. No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh god, he stopped.
stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Lily can still save him. I wish she could, believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee, I'm right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. God damn it, Lee, I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up! You're right, Kenny. Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see! I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! That's the only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! No! No, no, no! Let go of me! No! Please! God help us. I'm sorry. I Don't know you we... fucking touch me! Clementine. Clem. You okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. I'm sorry. We couldn't take that chance. You understand why we had to do this, Clementine. So we won't turn into one of those monsters? That's right. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. You, uh... You think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. What now? You got any ideas? The air conditioner. There might be a duck behind it. Oh, God. What are they doing to Katya and Duck? Katya and Duck. What about him? You don't think they're St. John's? No! They, they need Katya, remember? Well, she's the whole reason they brought us here. Sure. And, and Duck is valuable as a bargaining chip. We've got to get to them. It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, she probably sided with the St. John's against us. I know it was necessary, but I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. If 
the duck behind the air conditioner is big enough, we might have found our way out of here. Yeah? But I need something to loosen the screws. I got nothing. Shit. Hang tight. Maybe I can scrounge something. Get away. I just need to... I told you to get the fuck away! Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. I know you hate Kenny and me too. But he did what he had to, so we can all go on living. For what? He's got his family, and you've got Clementine. I've got nothing. You've left me with nothing. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver or a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Um, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Fucking vulture! Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. Got it? Yeah. One more should do it. Well, there's our way out, Lee. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Sakely. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. human slaughterhouse. Just forget about Lily right now. What are we gonna do about this guy at the front of the barn? Ugh. 
think I'm gonna be sick. Oh my God, what's wrong with these people? Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. Jesus, this is where they butcher people. Sick bastards, all of them. That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. You know, quit sitting out in the rain. Like What's he doing out there? there? I know. He says we no. can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. We want to keep. I'll keep an eye on him. Get ready to act when I say. See what he's doing now. Not the kid. Enough meat on the tray. What do you see? <laughs> oh, I know, Mabel. This is my favorite part too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> hey, and then keep your eye on look down. Sick fucker thinks this is a game. See where he is now. What's he doing? I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now. now. Give part of yourself so others can live. That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. Ah! This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. Fuck you, Lee. You and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive? Fucking ass. It's Katja! Please, no! Lily, please, keep her safe.
everyone okay? We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. They attacked us! I knew it! I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit! How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead! They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us! Shit! Is everyone else okay? They've still got Doc and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. I'm gonna take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy! Let's go, woman. Set her down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Where are Katja and the kid? Oh, God. Come here. Let me go! Lee, hit back! Don't come in here. This is bad to go around. Go, Brenda. Please, please don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. wanted his belly turned into a, a slaughterhouse. I'll kill her, Lee. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! What, what happened, Brenda? Your family was obviously smart. How, how did it come to this? Just stop! Ha! 
that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit! It's over! Fuck you! As soon as Dan and Mama get out here, you... you all fucked! <laughs> Said, it's over! Just walk away! Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Here and fight me like a man, Lee. Lee. They're getting in. Lee. Let's go. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah. And Clementine almost ate some. But? I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <clears throat> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready to roll. I want you to come with us. I mean it. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? Yes, Walker's probably got them. They were very bad people, and they were punished for it. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh god, not more strangers. Hello?
figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> hmm. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Who says it's your decision to make? Hey, we don't have time for this shit. Like it or not, we need this food. Now get over here and open the trunk, Lee. Supplies? I'll take it. More food in here. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. Well, think of it like you're holding on to it. You can give it back if we ever meet up with them, okay? Okay. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I'll find thinking it, I'll you're safe. You know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who took... Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. Making is done, pal. Ain't nothing left. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lee, I need you to back me up on this. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases anymore. It's starting to add up. 
I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? But we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! <laughs> 